I found something in the desert on Google Earth. What is it? I went to go find out. When I got there... I'm going to continue on by foot for the last hundred yards or so. Oh, I can see it right there. Something happened that I did not expect. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my gosh. While looking over Google Earth, I found this thing in the desert. Is it a cave? Is it a sinkhole? Is it some kind of secret portal to the center of the Earth? Well, I went to go find out. Going to continue on by foot for the last hundred yards or so. So as I'm driving out to this place, I am all alone. Oh, I can see it right there. There's no other cars, there's nobody else around. Yeah, it looks like a sinkhole or something like that. And I'm walking up to this big cave or sinkhole or something. And I see something in the bottom of this pit. <laughs> Whoa. There's somebody down there. And I think, what is somebody doing down there? And so I started to get a little freaked out. You know, I'm looking around for somebody's car. It's or is somebody living down there and they heard me coming up, so they're like standing there trying to freak me out. I don't know what's going on, but I know that they're way down there and I'm way up here. So even if they did try to come up and, you know, and get me or something, uh, I would still be able to get to my car in time and just get out of there, you know. That's creepy. So I was just still trying to figure it out. Plus I was thinking like, is this like a, a piece of wood that looks like a person? Hello? Yeah, what is that thing? Is this like a rock that looks like a person or something? I don't know what I'm thinking, to be honest. And so I'm just standing at this edge trying to figure out what is this thing and is it moving? Man, that is just really... Seeing that thing down there? I thought it was just somebody standing there. Like I just come up to this ledge and I'm the only one out here and I see this like figure down there standing. It's kind of freaky to be honest. I'm like looking around for a car or something or... Oh my gosh. What in the world? Should I go down there? So after looking at this thing for like a good five minutes, I have the idea to go down a little bit farther in this sinkhole or this cave or whatever it is and get a better picture of it. Ah, I forgot. I have my drone here, so I'm gonna fly my drone down there. I'm not gonna lie, that got my heart pumping really fast when I first saw that. Oh man, that's crazy. But I'm gonna try to get a little bit closer because there's like this trail right here. So I'm gonna try to go down a little bit to get a better view of whatever this thing is. That is just really freaky. And so I did. I went down there. And so I begin to go down and it's steep. It's, it's, it's difficult, it's not easy. What is that? Oh, it's so creepy. <laughs> if I could do this. Oh, man. Oh, that lizard. Doesn't even want to be down here either. I don't blame him. Oh, man, what is that thing? And so I start to go down, and I'm getting closer, and I can see this thing, and it's, it's, it's coming into view, and I, I still can't tell if it's a piece of wood or if it's a person okay. standing there or what, or is, it, is somebody playing a prank on me? I don't know. Okay, I'm like in this thing, and I can't tell if there's like a bee's nest somewhere around here, because there's just like tons of that, I don't know, like bee sound, beehive sound. Plus, I need a flashlight. I didn't even bring a flashlight. I didn't think I could come down this far into it. So this is kind of a... Oh, 
This is scary. Oop. <laughs> Why is it so scary to go over there? That was terrible. It seems like a dead animal or something. And as I begin to see this thing, I, I hear like this alarm go off. Man, where am I? Hear that? I hear like a beep. In my mind, I'm thinking, did I trigger an alarm or something like that? Is, is somebody backing up like a, a dump truck and they could dump a ton of dirt on me? I just don't know what's going on. And that really freaked me out. Like, is there, is there cameras, you know, looking at me? And I'm, some surveillance system going off? I don't know, I have all these things going through my head and I'm freaking out. <laughs> Plus I'm like down in this pit, you know? And uh, so I'm like, I'm getting out of here to figure out what is that beep? Cause when I pulled up, nobody was there. Oh my gosh. So the beeping noise, was my drone controller. I left it on up here. I was thinking there's like some alarm going off. I mean, obviously when I'm thinking rational, you know, like, you know, nothing's going on really. But just hearing an alarm when you're down there next to that dude, it's kind of freaky, so. Oh my gosh. That was just so random, huh? This is a freaky adventure. This is uh, not expecting any of this. So it's kind of a different weird adventure. Oh man. So it's like getting close to that guy. And all of a sudden I hear this alarm going off up here. I'm thinking, did somebody pull up? They're playing pranks on me. Is there like some camera going off? Camera surveillance system going off? Alerting that somebody's down there and I'm supposed to be down there. I don't know. But I took that as a sign to uh, come out and then I'll just fly my drone down there to get better views. <laughs> that is so freaky. This is a, whew, is it Halloween yet? This is crazy. <sighs> so what was that thing? Let's go fly my drone down there and see what this thing really was. Someone placed this here as a prank or shooting target or I don't know. Is this the Monopoly Man? You can see its top hat right here. Or is this some type of mannequin or statue or something else? What do you think? Well, whatever this is, I spent the next little bit flying my drone around to see what else there was. And I just found vandalism and some other things. So there's these guys that just pulled up. I see their uh, red SUV. I told them there's a surprise in there. <laughs> Isn't that funny how we kind of get worried or scared about something that doesn't really exist, you know, but in our minds, it's like 10 times more frightening. <laughs> uh, I think just the aspect of just being out here alone and then coming across that just makes it you know, five to 10 times more scary. Hopefully you got scared too, just like I did. Hopefully I'll see you on the next adventure coming up soon. Thanks for watching. <laughs>